The research that we just completed, which was funded by the U.S. National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, or NIH, the project is called Bangkok Online Testing on MSM. And what it is, is to assess the feasibility and acceptability of self-testing with online counseling among a group of young men who have sex with men, or we call young MSM. What's particularly unique about this group is that in Thailand right now, this group has uh, the highest HIV prevalence and also incidence in the country. So uh, prevalence in Bangkok is around 30% and incidence is as high as 12 per 100 person years. So, um, you know, HIV is treatable these days. I mean, they may not be a cure yet, um, but at least it's very treatable. And in Thailand, um, everybody who's living with HIV, who are Thai citizens, can have access to free antiretroviral therapy, which is provided by the Thai government. However, um, many people are not accessing um, this service. And on top of that, many people who are living with HIV do not even know that they have HIV. And so the problem is really at the testing. You know, we have all these venue-based testing, uh, whether clinics or hospitals, but a lot of men, uh, particularly young MSM, are not accessing it. And so I thought maybe we should think outside the box, think about other options. And so that's how we came up with this online HIV testing project. For this project, we focus on um, MSM who are between 18 to 24 years old. This is a, a feasibility and acceptability study and so at the very beginning we have qualitative research. Um, so these were focus group discussions to talk to different um, young MSM who are living in different places in Bangkok. You know, some live in downtown Bangkok, others maybe live in the suburban areas like Salaya for example. And we would ask them what are the barriers to testing at the venues, you know, whether clinics or hospitals. And they would tell us you know, whether sometimes they're worried about confidentiality, sometimes they're worried about um, the distance being so long and Bangkok traffic. Sometimes they worry about the stigma and the discrimination they may um, get from the, the healthcare providers at the different facilities. And because of these reasons, they choose not to come uh, and get tested at the venues. So we did the qualitative research, and then after that, then we designed this uh, self-testing um, project with the online counseling. So for that, we had um, uh, an online survey. We recruited men who are online, um, whether through um, apps that MSM use, or through Facebook, or through different websites that MSM uh, visit. We recruited 1,364 uh, young MSM, and of those, we randomized 75 men into um, our pilot study. And so for our pilot study, we, we send them a box that contains the self-test kits with an explanation. Uh, we also have a video clip that they can watch. Uh, we also hired a nurse counselor who gives them advice uh, and counseling online and also gives walk them through from the beginning uh, to the end. So they test, we call it baseline, so the first time, three months later they do it again, and then three months later they do it again. So we wanted to know whether um, they can do it, whether they come back and want to do it, and for those who are positive, um, if they can be linked to care and treatment. And I'm happy to say in our project, we had 100% linkage to care and support. In the test kit, uh, very similar to um, like a home pregnancy test. Uh, and so, um, you know, there's a couple of drops of blood and then in 15 minutes, the test will show whether you're positive or negative. But we also have a filter paper. Guys can also drop a couple of drops of blood on the filter paper and then they can mail that back into our labs and then we're able to test whether um, it's a true positive or if it's a true negative, just to confirm the result. ประทับใจในตัวเจ้าเครื่องตรวจตัวเนี้ยครับพี่เพราะว่าในปัจจุบันนะครับอ่าคนเราเนี่ยไม่กล้าไปตรวจ HIV ตามโรงพยาบาล
ยัง MSM อะครับก็ถือว่าเป็นการเพิ่มช่องทางให้มีความหลากหลายแล้วก็สะดวกมากยิ่งขึ้นในการตรวจ HIV ในปัจจุบันนี้ครับ We really want everyone to get tested because we know the treatment is working and we want everyone to access the free treatment that's provided by the government but in order to do that um, they need to know that they are positive so right now we have uh, mass testing campaigns we have mobile clinics but alone by itself doesn't seem to work and I think maybe in combination including the online testing it might increase the, um, the testing rate so that we are more with the UN AIDS 90-90-90 target.